All right, a new mural in a downtown Spokane business is making a statement. Our Dave Summers spoke to employees at a local marketing company laying down the groundwork for a new Black Lives Matter mural. I think art is powerful in reflecting what is happening in our time, and I think art can change the world. With the murder of George Floyd, felt like we needed to do something better and be better and set an example and so we had the idea to uh, do something with some local artists. My first initial thought was excitement that leaders in this community and leaders in the business community were willing to take this stand. We have so many amazing uh, creatives just in general in Spokane. The challenge was narrow narrowing it down and just wanted to try to have as diverse kind of representation of our local arts community as possible. Well, I think Black Lives Matter is a call to really, how do we remedy that? How do we have long-term sustained change in this country so that we are all equal and we're seen as human? We need help from all of the community to come together and show that each of us are valuable regardless of our colors and not even just black lives but all the other groups that are being oppressed. My artwork really focuses on the celebration of blackness, our joy, our resilience, and the contributions that we've made, not just our oppression because I think that's the part that gets missed sometimes is that sometimes you're only seen through your pain and your suffering. And I think it's really important for people in Spokane, people in the world, people in the country, to see black people through their contributions, through their joy. It's more of an opportunity to unlearn and to educate and to fight for all of our fellow human beings. One of my favorite quotes is by Nina Simone, and she says that it's the duty of an artist to reflect the times. And so I think that as an artist, um, what you're inspired by, what you feel, um, usually comes out in your work. Being able to work on it is so inspirational, so special to me. I think it just shows a lot of diversity of the different artists around here, and it celebrates not just one group, but all the different artists and all their different backgrounds and styles. Being out here in this parking lot and, and watching them work, there's been several times where people uh, are honking their horns as they're driving by and waving. It's kind of become a source of, uh, of pride. People can engage with it and they sometimes don't have a choice to hear or not hear the message. So people walking by or seeing this, they can't not see it. I personally was feeling a lot of anger over the last three or four weeks and really struggling with channeling that in a positive way. And this experience and this process and this project has allowed, has just brought a lot of peace to my heart. And I hope that it's doing the same for the artists involved. And I hope that it's doing the same for the black community here in Spokane. And I hope that it's doing the same for everyone who believes in the message. Um, and again, that it's making Spokane proud.